Yo, guys. Guess what I bet you weren't expecting to see again? This series. Yup, we're going to be surviving maps, IA maps with uh, America again. We have some new maps, so that will help me. Okay, I thought they changed that noise for a minute. Alright, just do some stuff here. Uh-huh. Get some setup in. Anyway, I like this emote. It's very cool. It is one of two good emotes this update. Also, yeah, okay, I don't need to show that. Okay, so first off, we'll start with this. The new JGN map, the thing that I can't pronounce. Can you survive America on it, even though it's blacklisted on this map? Today we'll find out. So it's a big map. It's got a lot of free open area. It's pretty easy to survive America on. If the need ever arises to stream upwards, you'll probably go flying out of the map. But otherwise... Yeah, it's, it's pretty easy. Anyway, real quick. I'm actually going to try and give my best pronunciation attempt to at this game. Ater Valzak. Alright, wait. Oh, there's a roof! Hold on. There's a roof! Okay, so good news. You don't have to worry about flying out of the map. You can just, like, if you actually... If you're, like, doing JGN in a public private server and you got America, guess what you can do? Whatever the heck you want. It does not matter. Anyways, yeah, that's... that's up. up next. Atlanta Waffle House parking lot at 3 a.m. Oh, this one. This one's also pretty cool. And I like how like, it gives lore to the maps of Item Asylum. You've got the arcade here, and then you can go to Townie, you can go to nothing. You can go to Grand's Mall, and you can go to Scary. It's pretty cool. Anyway, so it's a pretty big map, but one main thing is that you can't die here. If you have America, literally just aim and shoot. It does not matter. You will not die. Pretty, actually, like, this is a pretty good update so far for doing this challenge. Like, yeah, no, the walls, the invisible walls extend up pretty high. You do not... Yeah, sure, whatever. Okay, so... But, like, for the most part... You don't have to worry about dying. Okay, just don't do that. <laughs> don't do that. Okay, so as I thought, invisible walls never extend forever. So Wait, don't what? aim directly upwards, but it's not like as if you're going to do that anyway, because, like, you know, directly downwards, you know. So, also I hate this weapon. It's so bad. So you got the arcade dummy, you shoot him, you're alive, easy. Life is Roblox. Next. We're gonna do Boxing Ring, I like this. This is a Smash reference, and I think it's cool. This is, like, again, this is another example, like... I've seen the, um... I've seen the... Invisible Walls here. You will not die on this map if you fire America, it does not... Crap, I'm an idiot. What?! Okay, actually, real talk here, what killed me? Why did she use gender reveal? I hate her. Oh my god. Is that melee? Hi! Hot Bannon! Anyway, they made this a melee, that's really hot. But like. Uh, I guess, like, Hi. part of my. main part of my character card just went into the ground. Yeah, okay. So there's one rule. And we've actually experienced this in the last video. Don't aim down. Don't, don't aim down. But you can aim anywhere else. As long as you're not aiming towards the ground, you will live if you shoot America. It doesn't matter. It, it doesn't matter. Ah, uh, casino. Did we do casino? Hold on, I have a- I actually have a document up. We didn't do casino. It wasn't here last time, so we can do it this time. I think. Let's test out casino. So here's the thing.
thing about Casino, the correct, the quick answer is no, you can. But, I mean, like, probably, hold on. Alright, so that's, that's a bad start. So Casino did get an update, though. It got the room with the gambling. Let's try and go for multiple balls. One more chest, but I'm pretty sure that Casino isn't a map you can survive America on, but that's fine. Like, it doesn't. Eh... Oh my god! Oh wait, okay, I thought that was going to be So, like, it's not like as if it's a new map or anything. Oh! Boy! Okay. Well, you don't want this to happen. Although, you can do that. Alright, we're gonna try one more time, because that, that was close. That was good. Because, like, if you go for all of these walls... Hold on. Alright, anyway. <laughs> I'm, I'm kind of a good gambler. Um... <laughs> so, we went- we were in that room. And we went through that wall, this wall, and that wall. In fact, we would have lived if there was anything over here, but there's not. So we're gonna do... This is doable. I think this is possible. I've got... I've got one last... We're gonna try... This. Oh! You see it, though. It, I think it's doable, in theory. I don't want to spend too much time on Casino. But, um... Oh, damn, this is a level. Okay. Um, like, if you're skilled, if you aim it right, you can probably... Hey! Oh, my God, we did it! We lived! So, yeah, it's doable. It's, like, very precise aiming. Which is fine, but it's doable. Nice. All right. Moving on on our list. So we couldn't do ZS City last time, because guess who wasn't here? My, um, another player. However, we have another player now, so that, yeah, since she's here, we can do this. Now, I need to be a zombie, good. Because if I'm an, a survivor, then when I die, it's over. So we're gonna see if we can survive. Now, America's Blacklist. Okay. Okay. So, the question is, can you survive America on City? Well, that's a bad start. The good news is I'm a zombie, so like, if I was a survivor, would I die? Round ends, not good. We got more tests. I have some more places I want to try out. This, so first off, you can try aiming on the ground here. This, and I tried to get into the room with the pit. Maybe I went through the pit. Oh, you can, you can interrupt the screen. So, like, if you're about to miss scream, you can interrupt it. That, uh, information for ZS players. Hey! Almost! Almost! We almost did. Now, again, so America's Blacklist did on ZS, so all of this is absolutely useless information if, if you do figure this out. Oh, I think I know why. I can't be ragdoll. Okay, hold on. I'm a tank, so I can't be ragdoll. Yeah, I mean, if you're a tank and you get America by some stroke of luck, which will never happen, um, you'll live. Good, e good news. Good news, guys. Is she throwing flashbangs at me like it's sort of Yeah, that's a flashbang. Alright, so... I wanna be up there. What we're gonna try and do is we're gonna try and... I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't think it's doable. It's just so hard. Oh, uh, it's really like, it's a big challenge. City is such a tiny map with thin walls. It's not the easiest thing in the world. Yeah. We're gonna call this an L. It's not doable. Um, we did not do Condemned Town. Yeah, that's a new map. So we have two loads of new maps. Wait, oh, I didn't see us! No! Okay. I think we're good. So, Condemned Town. The voice scratch. Um, it's a 
the thing about Condemned Town is it has this dock, but the rest of the map is absolutely safe, although you can bounce off this wall because it's very solid, and just kind of... Oh no! Even still. So firing America on um, Condemned Town is pretty safe, actually would have died there if it wasn't for that light, so try and avoid... So first off, just make certain that the docks aren't behind you, and uh, make certain that you're not about to, like, kill yourself. Like this, yep, as I, uh, so, yeah, it's doable. It's possible to get you. So try and make it, you gotta do a little bit of angling, proportioning, plus a meteor damage, you know, which is very sad. Um, but it's pretty easy to do, to pull off, surviving. easy to do this. Especially right here. This should be, yeah. It's very easy to do. Don't worry about it. We'll worry about it a little, but, you know, not too much. So we left off last time doing Critical Strike, but we have Crust Cove to do, so we're gonna do that. So the thing about Crust Cove is, um, it's actually very open, and it will probably not be the best map for surviving America. There's this pirate ship, that's a bit of a W, but still, even with this, because like, it'll be easy to knock yourself out of this ship. So as you can see, it's pretty open, there's not a lot of leniency, and I think that water will kill you. I'm gonna try it though, we're gonna use the pirate ship as some leverage, SS ship. Oh! Oh yeah! Let's go! I did it! I did it. Alright, so that's one way. So, um... Wait. Okay, never mind, I was wrong. We're gonna try it this way. Okay, so that's me bouncing, and... So it's very close. It's a close call. You can fire America on Crest Cove, but, like, that's... Th these directions will not work. You have to, like, make certain you're aiming towards a wall, like a ship or something. And be very careful, because... Yeah, there's this guy. Let's, but let's try it from inside the ship. Thank you, game. Um, yes. So, we got this safe wall right here, because this this part's more open. So if you're going to do it inside the ship... Uh... Close. Very close. I could have aimed a little lower. That probably would have helped the solution. Surprisingly, though, Crust Cove is pretty safe for this sort of thing. As I said, I ended off on Critical Strike. No, I didn't. I did Crossroads. Ah, okay. I ended off on Dodgeball, which is a removed map now, very sadly. So we can... We're gonna do Doomspire. That's next. So, we're so now we're back on the regular maps list. Oh, I should have been keeping track of which ones I did in the document. I'll do that later. Huh. Also, new song. So yeah, that's cool. Ada Mayo put out some new remixes for a lot of maps to get them near their own unique theme. So one big problem is that this map is not well made for surviving. Like most of the fighting happens up here, and if you fire America up here, you're dead. So yeah. However, if you fire America from down here, you live. Look at that. So if you're gonna use America, try and get one of the people who fell down here. Because these walls are pretty sturdy, I think. Yeah, okay. So the reason that we're that time is because so the sturdiness of the walls depends on the force. Close up with mine. Depends on the how like quickly you're coming at the wall. If you start coming at the wall from a far distance like this, the wall will do a good job defending you. But if you come at the wall from a closer distance, giving you less time to slow down like this, you're gonna go right through it. So it's actually a very small window where Surviving America on Doomspire will work. And with that we do Dropship. Dropship was from the, la the first video, the first iteration of this series.
Wow. Okay. Um. And we had sh we had a problem doing this. It wasn't working. But my sister says that she did it. She successfully survived Miracon Dropship. So we're gonna try this. It will. It's probably doable. Like. Yep. Easy. There's a lot of walls. As long as you put yourself at a good distance between these walls, it, I even stayed in the same room. Probably like. Aim it. Wow. Yeah, you can you can just survive America in this room simply. But let's try a little closer. So we go through the wall, but we're still good. So yeah, you can survive it on dropship. We move on to dual screen. This one will be a quick and easy answer. We don't need to spend too much time doing this one. Because it's dual screen, there are no walls. There is not really any conceivable way that you can survive America on dual screen. We will try. Go away! Anyway. So we're going to try and use this. But it will probably just send us flying up. Whoa! Oh my god! Okay, wait, wait, wait. I wasn't expecting this at all. I'm alive. How am I alive? Hold on. Whoa. Okay. And we aimed, we aimed a little low. Okay, so that time it didn't work. I got stuck in the DS. And it let me live. Can we pull this off again? I want to see this. Oh my god. I got so Okay. I got, I got so, this is actually an insane loadout on this game, god, this is, this is really good. Anyway. So we're gonna try if we, if we can, see if we can replicate this, just aim a little low, not too low. Yeah, I don't know. I guess you gotta get good RNG or something. Highly unlikely, but if you're lucky, you can survive it. We move on to Final Destination, which I think will be another open and shut case, but... Maybe. Um, so we've got a lot of, like, big thingies. It's like a big open map most of the time. But, we do have a lot of sort of wall things, and, uh... Wow, okay, this was not the way I intended to survive, but you could do that. So there's that. Don't... I wouldn't recommend doing it right next to it. It probably won't work. Yeah. So the thing about the walls is that they have a high chance of being able to fling you off the map. So it's definitely going to be a lot about angling. Successful angling. Hey, look! I'm not going to do that because that might take a little bit. Um, or something. But if you aim it right... No, not, e not even. I guess I got lucky that one time, because, like, these things, you'll bounce off of them. They're not very sturdy to protect their walls. They will send you flying. And you gotta, like, be careful. Especially, like, if you do it this way, there's a lot more gaps, less open area. Like, I somehow flung myself right through the grab, so if you do do it, you do shoot America. I wouldn't recommend this way, I'd recommend this way, even though... Okay, so aim a little lower, probably. If aim a little lower, it'll give you a higher chance of survival, probably. But you can get close to that, so. Maybe sort of kind of doable, we move on to fish tank. Kind of breezing through these. I'm trying to be a little more concise. Okay. Okay. So this is gonna be tough because these walls are very thin. So it's gonna be very hard to pull this off. Because oh wait, we, we did it. But that's probably because of the distance we were going for. Because if you do it a little bit closer, and in fact if you do it like this, it's probably gonna have less of a chance of survival. Yep, yeah, we go right to the wall. So. You have to go lengthwise. I don't. I don't know. You have to do the longer. You have to fire it along the longer region. Oh, I. Thank you, game. They, they knew exactly what I wanted. But yeah. So as I'm saying is, if you do this a little closer, like I did that right next to the edge, a little bit closer, you'll probably end up dying. That was me dying because I went to the ground, which probably didn't affect me. Try one more time. Not have that 
I'm so fast! Oh, like so yep, we went right through the wall. And another thing, we hit the corner. We had two walls protecting us. That might have something to do with it. So I'm gonna do one more test. Okay, so I, yeah, I bounce off, so I'm bouncing off the ground here into the corner, but does that work the other way? How well does that work in the other direction? Oh, yeah, okay, so if you kill someone, like, around this region, aiming this way, then it'll work pretty well, you can probably survive here. Now we move on to another one of the newer maps, Green Run Town. Let's see what it's so a green run town. Definitely an opener, definitely an open type map, but we do remember a while ago when I did this. Or something, I don't know. Okay, so. Yeah, so this is gonna be. Like, we do this. Oh, wait! We're alive! No, we're not. Okay. Hey, skills are more fun. Okay. So, the thing is. You probably don't want to aim down this way, or down that way. No, you want to aim for the houses. You want to go for the houses. What? I may have aimed towards the ground, I don't know. But probably for the houses will be the best bet. Also, this weapon... So, like, if you're, like, up here, and you're fighting zombies, and you kind of aim like this, that's your best bet. And, well... Well, again, America's blacklist, but you can see I send myself all the way to another building across the map. I live, and it's not going to work as well if you try any other way like this. There's not a lot to stop you and your momentum. I hate this weapon too. It's, it deals self-damage, even if you hit nothing. It's so dumb. So we're going to do one more building test. We're going to go right inside the building, and yep right back into the bowling alley, so it's pretty easy to do if you aim it right. We move on to Grinder. I remember doing Grinder. No, not Grinder. Grand Small. So Grand Small, normally this wouldn't be in discussion, but Elim. So also, but also they added all those like cool sets to Elim. So the thing is, I'm not even sure if you can get America on Elim anymore. This might not be worth talking about. You might not be able to get America on Grand Small. But one thing about Grand Small is that it's big, and it has a lot of things. So surviving America on Grand Small is a rather easy and simple task. As long as you don't act like an idiot and shoot like right here. Like, that, that'll that obviously kill you. But if you shoot like this, yeah, you'll live. You're, like, you, I, mean, I mean, your safest bet is obviously go in here and shoot, because you have a bunch of walls in the way, but even without that... Yeah, maybe just... I don't know. That's the best strategy, in my opinion. Don't aim... I mean, can you do this? Hold on. I'm gonna go like this. Yeah, I didn't think so. Those walls aren't strong enough. So obviously, like Fish Tank, there's like a set direction you should set out to aim from. And like... So I said inside the theater, but I meant like... If you actually go inside one of the theaters, this looks really bad on the land if you do that, then you'll most likely live. And well, if you're in Elam and you do this, that's pretty helpful, unless of course you're not in the, uh, so, hold on, I'm like, my character's kind of freaking out. I'll try to Hellgate out of here. And, um, there are things that it can kill you in here, obviously, like my P. Oh, no, I got out. Awesome. Oh, she got it! Was she trying to survive with it? Guys, do you think she lived? I have no idea. I didn't deal damage, so I can't. We'll find out soon. It's just one more. Yep! Alive. Sounds like she died. Maybe she had to reset. Anyway, Grind Small is pretty easy. Now we do Grinder. Now it's time for Grinder. Anyway, as I was saying earlier, if you're on Elam and that happens to you and you're not in the, um, safe zone, that would be pretty bad. So one thing we did about Grinder last time is we tried to make use of these walls, but it's very difficult. And, so the thing about that, yeah, 
there's only two walls and they're pretty thin, so it's not very good for protection. If you aim a little higher, yeah. Good so night, I don't girl. Know, I'll see you tomorrow. I don't think you can survive a marathon grinder. I've seen people like go for the stop in the walls. Also, this is a miscellaneous. It's sad. I will be making a video on this later. Um, like I've been seeing people get stuck in the walls, but they always fall outside. It just, it's not gonna work. You most likely cannot survive America on Riders. It's just gonna not be. Do your worst! We don't talk about that. Okay. Try. Yeah. See, I, I even went up there. It's My not, name is not doable. Jim. Now it's time for Jim. I think I've done Jim before too. Can't fully recall. <laughs> so the thing about Jim, obviously don't shoot from here, don't shoot, don't shoot from there. Don't be an idiot. Don't shoot him with places that will obviously kill you. Shoot like this maybe. I didn't think so. Because like there's no wall stopping you, it's just directly to the gymnasium wall, which is pretty thin, so that's not wise, don't do that either. But, but, you could do this. Don't even throw <laughs> Alright. Try again. Hey, first I like this thing, because I like making ball jumps. Ball jumps are good, so Anyway, trying this again. What? What is that angling? What happened? I got, I want to say I might need to look back at that with my cursor and see where I aim at. We're going to try it inside the gymnasium. My verdict is that it's not doable. I am... What the heck? Um... Halberd can't survive American gym. But Halberd, you also probably can't survive. I mean, first off, most people fight um, outside the Halberd, which would kill you. That would, you would die if you tried to shoot this outside the Halberd, I'm pretty sure. But if you tried to shoot it inside, well, well you'll most likely live. Um, eventually. Yeah, this wouldn't be very fun to have happen to you. Okay, match with it. Alright, we're gonna try this again. So you can try that, like, there's a low chance that it'll probably happen, or maybe there's a high chance, I don't know. Let's try doing this. Or not. Let's see if I spawn outside of this, so I can test that. It. Just find another! Flip it! First off, I want to try shooting America up here. You're probably going to die. Oh wait, they added the claw! That wasn't there before, does it work? Oh my god. Okay, so that works. I didn't actually expect that. So you can try that, and if you're trying to kill someone over here, that will also work. Partially. Actually. What? Good news! So it seems that this map is pretty good for doing the surviving of America. Okay, I went right for the help. Maybe not... Maybe not there. But, here. Things like this. Like this wall right here, this is super sturdy. And if you get really close to it, you won't bounce off of it. I don't really know how I died. So fire damage. Again, inside here, not hard, I'll just kind of end up stuck. I don't even know where I'm at. But that's it, you can certainly no! freeze and survive it. No! 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 Happy. Ah, happy home. Yeah, that one. That one's fun. No, no, no! <sighs> Alright, I kind of clutched that.
a link sword. Wait, I. This is also pretty cool. I like this thing. So the best strat is this house, which probably won't work because it's got thin walls. Yup! Right through it. We even went pretty far. Right through it. I don't see this working. Also, this is miscellaneous, but I don't care. That's a good choice. Try and get some distance. We're gonna try one more time. Max distance. I bounced off of it! I, I bounced off of it. Really? I remember doing Happy Home. It just would be nice if I could, like, get something that will... Speed boost. None of these have speed boost. So we're just gonna walk all the way there. Or we'll use that! Yes! Okay. Stop fucking firing at me, you dumbass. Okay, shit's happening. I think I went for the windows! Whatever, you can't survive it on Happy Home. It's not the Hatsune World. So Hatsune World used to be super flat. And, like, there was no way... Like, I think that was in the original video, too. It was, like, really flat, and there was no way you'd ever survive America on it. And now it's bumpy, and there's still no way you'd ever survive America on it. Because it'll fling you upwards, like, on dual screen. But we could try those more solid rocks. This doesn't give you speed. I don't wanna... First off... Yeah. So, I just rode up the hill, and then eventually went back down, and died. Oh, uh, hey, look at this. This is a crappy loadout inside. It's a silly weapon that I really like, but I wish it was better. Oh, wait, she has the... She has the Amori. Um, she has that one kid that's funny. This is the real knife and this two soys. One wonder what her projectile is. Alright, we're gonna try this. So, we're gonna try really close. Nope! Right over it! There's no way. You're not surviving. You can try to bounce off of one of the black pillars, but that would take way too much calculation. We're moving on the Haunted Mansion. I love this lobby. Just the inverted colors are really nice. In fact, let's see how America looks here, real quick. Yeah, it's black, so I didn't expect it to look like complete black. Also, you get to see the voting icons all different. Like, look at this! The swapped color palettes are really nice, and this orange character is now blue. It's so- it's- it's a really fun lobby. You, you should, like, honestly just- you- take out every item, try out all the avatars with it. Also, this thing is really hard to use. Anyway. Haunted Mansion's probably pretty easy, and there's- I can't wait for that. I think that's weird. Still annoying. Alright, well, at least I got sunshine in the back, so it works out. So there's, like, land underneath this hill, so it's not like as if this is gonna reject you. Yep, you're gonna end up through it. Now, again, you'll never get a Maricon Haunted Mansion due to primary cause, blacklisted front game, CS. But you can very easily survive America on it, but only if you're on the lower levels. Like this. Otherwise, you're gonna die. If you go up on the Haunted Mansion level, you probably have a high chance of dying. We'll check it out. Real quick. Too bad I don't have the zombie letters. I like to walk around. I can do this. Nope, not high enough. Come on, I know, I know this is high enough. There we go. So, obviously don't fire that way, and don't fire this way, but what about this way? No. Yeah, Haunted Mansion is too mid, too... Its walls are too thin. Whole play! This one will be an open and shut case, there's no way. Um. But. So yeah, on Haunted Mansion, if you're gonna use America, use it down there. Anyway, we can just do this really quickly. No. You cannot survive America on whole play. That, that's it. It's not doable. If you're gonna use it, you're gonna die. Hospital! I wonder if this is another one of those broken maps. I don't think so, though. 
smile him. Whoa! Wait, I, I had a smile in Moscow! Oh, hey, it's Azuri. I bet I probably would need to explain to you what's happening. Also, this also has a new theme. So obviously, don't use... Don't use America up here. You will die. There is no... Well, maybe I'll die. No, you're gonna die. Don't, don't do it. I don't use it in here either. That's, that's dumb. Don't use it. No, instead, do something like this. Just kidding. We've done this before. That doesn't work. So is it possible to survive America on hospital? I don't think so. I really don't think so. There's just, like, you can try this, but you go through because it's, even if the walls are in thin, is it, it's in such a condensed area that it's really hard to do. And I just don't foresee it happening. You're not gonna survive America, most likely. So we're moving on to Hostile Takeover. Now, I heard this map got an update, which I am glad for because I hated it. It was so big. It was so uh, annoyingly big. Yes, there's obstacles now. This map is viable now! Because, like, it was so big, people could just snipe you from here to here. And now there's things. What, what is that? What is that? They also gave it its own theme instead of the annoying song that nobody likes. This map's actually good. I might vote it for now. Vote for it now. I'm just kidding. It's still humongous. Oh, that's funny. Funny reference. Okay. So, can you survive? American Hostel Takeover? Yes! Just don't aim too high, because those walls are really low. What the? Oh, right! Because it's a hostile takeover. And he's deal damage! Wait, hold up. I gotta watch this. So, they, this, is, so this is a full reference to the hostile takeover meme now. Unlike prior. And they drop bombs or something? What are they doing? This is so fun. Oh, I'm gonna try getting him out of one of these cards. Okay, one shot, no, it also just deals 45. Minutes. So what I want to do is I want to try... This is really fun. If Azuri kills me, I'm banning him. Alright, so I want to see... So even though it's pretty easy to survive America, because, you know... It's a big map. Now the thing is, here, now that there's things around, that, like hazards, which are really fun, there's one thing you gotta, uh, really gosh, you gotta worry about, and that's getting in. That's being in. So, yeah, as I said before, don't go too high. Like, make sure to aim your attacks so you're gonna go over. So, there's the risk, you're running the risk of getting hit by these things, which deal 55 damage, that's a lot. Inside, so this thing isn't so empty. Like, jeez. This map is so boring. It's so, like, rushed. Now it's got confidence to it. And you can hardly tell it was a reference to the meme. Anyway, going through the building doesn't make much of a difference. This is not very safe. Now I want to try using this and getting hit. Okay, that's that. Incinerator! And we're almost done. I'm actually going to finish with um, the eyes. Gonna, or maybe even... Nah. I'm gonna finish with Isla de la Muerte, and that's it. So we're gonna do Incinerator first. Oh, hey, this silly guy. Anyway, he's probably gonna kill me while I'm trying to do this. Which is, is why that was gonna say, okay. Incinerator, is it possible to survive America on Incinerator? Probably. That looks like a yes. This was, this is even the same room. Wow, I, wow, this is the same room. However, if you're an idiot, you might do this, which will give you, uh, which might get you killed. Oh, wow, you just ran right Good job, buddy. Anyway, so you might, if you do it like that, if you don't watch where you're aiming, you're liable to run into this. And that, and also, it doesn't work all of the time. You also have to be careful with that. Because these walls are pretty thin, and sometimes it just won't work. But yeah, again, if you aim carelessly, you run the risk of running into the flame hazard. There's a lot to... Like, there's actually a lot more thinking of shooting America in Incinerator than you think there is. And... Wait. 
I actually, I think I remember this. You can only fire it in one room. And that's the room. That's not this room. If you fire it in this room, you're probably going to die. I don't know why. It just... It's very low. I think I remember that one. If you fire it in this room, you have a high chance of living. Unless you're unlucky like that. Um, anyway, so let's do it. Now we do Incinerator V2, the updated version of the exact same map. Yay. I love Anyway, so it's basically the same map. There's like little to no changes. In fact, it's just visual changes. This is the same map. Wow. Obviously still doable. Kind of almost went for the wall, but we're good. Oh, I love I love Link Sword. I wanted this item in the game for so long, and now I've got it. Look at this! And now I'm happy. I'm really happy. Like I wanted the classic sword, and it's just as I expected it to be. The exact same with no changes. And I'm happy about that. That's so cool in my opinion. So yeah. Just like with Incinerator, Surviving America on Incinerator V2 should be a piece of cake with minor dings to pay attention to, like the lava hazard and which room you're from. Also, the one good thing about this map is that they added this ladder, and I think it's really cool. Yeah, so... It should be pretty simple. And with that, we'll do the last map for this video. Isla de la Muerte, which is Spanish for something that I don't know. <clears throat> now, hopefully I don't take so long to make the next video that there's the two whole updates of maps released. But you never know. So obviously, if you're going to fire this America on Isla de la Muerte, don't fire it this way. Fire it this way. Because then you'll have a high chance of living, especially because like this cave is real. There's actually stuff in this cave. And so... Actually, let's try it inside the cave towards the up, wa up water. I doubt it. I doubt it. Whoa! Uh. Oops. I found this area. All right. Yeah, so this is obviously the rest of the cave, but you're not supposed to go in here, so if you go in here, you're not getting out. Now, I can understand why this happened. I just opened my stupid file explorer. Okay. So I went for this wall, and then bounced off the second wall. So if you're gonna fire America in here, you gotta be wary about that. But also... Oh! That's something. Can I continue to riot myself out Yo, nice. Alright, one more dude. One more. Nope. There we go. Alright, so yeah. Most of the time... Fire no. Just don't fire it in those directions. Although, so you can't fire it this way or this way. But can you fire it towards the fort thing? My guess is yes. I think this should work. But we're about to test. And it works! That worked pretty well. We survived. And we survived almost. We kind of almost fell off, but. So if you try to do it like this, so you can go inside the fort and try and give yourself leverage if you try to fire in the direction of the pirate ship, but it's unlikely. Alright, I guess, so we were about to be done, but apparently she has something she wants to show me, so I'm gonna look. That'll be the end of the video, that's it. One, one silly secret. Aha! You're not normally supposed to be able to get up here. And if you do, what do you find? This silly thing! Awesome! Alright, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Goodbye forever. If the